Oh man, that was really bad. Just bear with me, y'all. I'll get better, I promise. Are you really kidding? <laughs> Don't worry, Mom, the truck will work. <laughs> Bye, Mom. Thanks for driving us. You're welcome. Bye. Have fun. Yep. <laughs> you got bug spray? Yes. Right, yes. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you. 
come out here and give you a quick garden tour for those of you who like that sort of thing. This year I planted my garden kind of in like a fan shape. It's like shorter on one side and longer on the bottom and then I planted the rows kind of like on angles. The tomatoes being in the middle there. So yeah we have a few tomatoes that are just starting. I'm excited for those. We have cucumbers right here. Then we have a row of carrots, and my garden is not weed free at all, so yeah. <laughs> we have broccoli next, and the chickens have kind of eaten those up there on the end. <laughs> and next to the broccoli we have sweet potato, and then I have a row of beans, but I did not make time to put the poles in so they're kind of like laying all over. I don't know if they're going to be that great this year. Well, we are getting some beans, just a few. So on this side of the tomatoes, we have zucchini. They're just black beauty, I think, squash zucchini. And this one right here, though, ended up being a French white zucchini, and I had never even heard of them. I had to look it up when I saw how white they were. And I don't know if there's some growing right now. I think we picked them all, yeah. But um, it's really, they're really pretty, and I just, I think it was just kind of like a mistake or an odd seed in the bunch. So kind of enjoyed those, but we've been getting tons of zucchini. Lots and lots going on in there. And over here, this overgrown row, well, one of the rows here is beets. They go all the way up. My kids actually love beets and we just saute them up and we do the beet greens. So next to the beets, we have a row of radishes, which I planted way too close together. And I pulled out a ton of them while they were growing I thought I pulled out enough, but they just did not form any radishes for us this year. We got, I think, two. <laughs> so we've been pulling them out and eating the greens a little bit, but we really, I should probably just take them out. And over here I have some zinnias, and I did grow a row of like herbs. There's parsley and basil. I think I have, yeah, there's an echinacea here, but I don't think it's really going to do much this year a little behind so maybe next year and we have all the nasturtiums they like to hide their little flowers like to hide underneath nasturtiums taste so good in salads my kids like to eat them all the time too they're also nice to have in the garden because they repel bugs so they kind of work well just all around so yeah, I think that's about it. That's all I had to show you. It's lots of, lots of fun. The kids love the garden. Can I pull up another one? Sure. Yeah. Let's see if one's sticking up. I see a garden spider, Mama. A garden spider? 
you get one? Nope. Nope. Okay. Those radishes. What'd you uh, find? A radish. Wow, we got one. What do you got? Um, a nasturtium. Are you going to eat it? <gasps> what? Do you like it? Yeah? You want to get another one? Get one for Anna. Uh -uh. No. <laughs> get one for Anna. Anna, do you want a spicy flower? Yeah. Anna loves them. <laughs> I found one. I found one. I found one. I found one. Woohoo. Good picking, Rose. She <laughs> picked them, but I. I saw one and Kate wanted to pick it, so I let her pick it. Oh, nice. And then Kate picked these three. Nice. These four. You got one too? Don't get poked. Yay! Mom, I got one. Good job. Well, there's way too much. Cute. What you got? A pumpkin. A pumpkin? Yeah. No, it's a cucumber. Tomatoes are getting so big, they're falling over. So right now we are heading over to a friend's house. They have a honey business and they have a bunch of hives and they are going to be extracting the honey from the hive today. So we are going to go watch the whole process and the kids are pretty excited about it. So it goes through this machine and it's got hot knives that cuts that wax off. You know, the bees had it all capped. So the hot knives cut the wax off so the honey will flow out. <laughs> That's pretty neat. Okay, slide it back in there. Honeycomb. This is what we end up doing on date night. a good old time. She hopped out when the other one got loose. <laughs> yeah, We're taking the cows to the farm today because they are outgrowing their 
hutches and it rained yesterday so they're really muddy. Okay, watch out. I got a big one. Why don't you move out? Getting wet. <laughs> Woo! We are eating ravioli on the porch. And what what else are we eating, Anna? Um, and beets from the garden. And it is pouring rain and thunderstorming outside. <laughs> It's just coming off the porch like a waterfall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Heading down to the river. This is the property that my parents own and the property that I grew up on. Are you scared? Oh, kinda. <laughs> okay. Go? Yeah, sure, go right in. No, I'm too scared. <laughs> you can do it, just drop. It was like fun, Kate. You're out over the water, just let go. Let go, go. You have a life jacket on, you'll you'll float. Gabe. Let go. Let go, let go. Not anymore. No, someone has to go with me. Can't. You can do it. Again. Go, 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 go. It's really fun. Let go, let go, let go. Woo! Good job. <laughs> you did it, Kate. Good job. You can do it, Leah. It's really, really fun. Leah, are you scared? You can do it, Rose. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Just hold on tight, and when you get out there over the river, then just let go. I gotta watch this. Oh, Grandpa's watching. You can do it. It's okay. It's not that far. You wanna do it one more time, Kate? Okay, you show her how it's done. Okay, you can do it. Are you nervous? I'm not a little bit. You've never done it before, and this is your own rope swing. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, Mama will 
go now. I've done this before, but now I'm like nervous. Why? I don't know. Watch out, Gabe. Oh, mama. <laughs> you <scared. Not> going. <laughs> Not going to. It's a lot further down than last time I did it. Yeah, right. It is. You don't think it's as far down for the kids? Oh, I know. Okay. <laughs> The water was up really high, like way higher. <laughs> okay, I'm going. Gabe, you can do it. I know you can do it. We're gonna be planting a willow on the other side of the river. Oh, 
Oh, Dad, do you think he'll tip over? He ain't gonna tip over. But I didn't bring my good shovel. <laughs> Just in case. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> yes. It'd be my good shovel now, just in case. Don't knock that shovel in the river, Gabe. You gotta go upstream, bud. Upstream. Sit back Gabe. farther. Sit. Gabe. Dad. Oh my goodness. Gabe, careful. Go slow. Get the river. Hey. Oh my. Do you think he can do this? There you go. <laughs> oh my word. My dad wants this willow on the other side of the river. <laughs> He's supposed to go the other way. Current's taking him a little bit. Almost gonna make it. So we planted the willow right here across the river from us. Hopefully it'll grow into a nice big tree someday. We planted some on both sides of us so we have some big willow trees someday. Ha <laughs> ha